Um, my name is Sandra Cormack and my business is Sandra Cormack Professional Hair and Makeup Artist, formerly SC Makeup Artistry, um, based in Dundee but travel throughout the UK. I'm Ross Grattan. Um, my business is currently Blue Bottle Crafts. Um, I, I, I basically I uh, take labels from bottles and uh, upcycle them into creating table coasters that people can use, kind of at their dining tables. Um, I also kind of make frame frames by scratch, so um, people can pick their kind of favourite beers and have a, a set of their favourite kind of coasters up on their wall and things like that. I've been trading for just over seven years now. Um, each day is always different. I've had lots of amazing clients, um, including um, Dundee Rep Theatre, um, BBC, CNBC, um, what were celebrities, including Arlene Phillips, Edith Bowman, um, Nina Miskov, Scouting for Girls, just to name some. Mm and a lot of MPs and MSPs. Um, I just recently was a makeup artist for Jenny Mara's MSP's wedding, which was fantastic. At Christmas was quite a big time for me. I got, I was quite busy, had quite a lot of orders. Um, the current uh, thing I'm working on is uh, getting basically permission from uh, Scottish craft beer breweries. Um, and that then allows me to create sets that I'm planning to get into shops and get them sold online um, on my own website. Um, so it's quite a big kind of big stage at the moment. I really enjoyed my time here. It, it was fantastic um, being around um, different people who I wouldn't necessarily be working alongside. Um, because I'm my own boss, sometimes I am isolated. Um, in my own business, so it's difficult to mix with people unless you're actually physically doing hair and makeup. So to be in an environment around um, other creatives, especially techie people, uh, was great for me because I'm not particularly techie. So if I was like looking for help um, for things, they were around and they had loads of patience with me, and they were just a great bunch of people, really welcoming environment and I, I would say to anybody who is thinking of coming here definitely give it a go because everybody, staff, other people um, that use the space are all really welcome and really helpful and um, supportive. Uh, yeah, yeah definitely. The um, My business idea was literally just an idea when I first came in here and um, when I originally started I hadn't even thought about creating it as a as a business. It was purely um, a hobby thing, and I I had my own kind of beer bottles sitting in sitting in my house that needed to kind of do something with because they were taking up space. Um, and yeah, it just kind of escalated in here. I I didn't even kind of realise that there would be kind of a market for it, but um, it's purely been down to being in here in the Stinky Bear that it is what it is just now. So yeah, definitely need to think about <laughs> You know, it's a work in progress, it's quite a new space, so um, I suppose it's something that as you go along, you'll, you know, you'll be getting feedback from people, um, including myself, to say maybe you could have this, that, and the next thing. For me, I, I just think it's, it's great how it is. Um, uh, yeah, I, there's nothing really I could suggest you could do more of, really. I, I think from a purely just me kind of thing, I think when I first um, kind of agreed to kind of come in here, I think there was plans for um, like a creator space. Um, I, I know obviously the kind of plans changed and stuff, but that would have, um, I think that would have helped me out quite a bit. Um, I think I could have got a bit further with the frames and stuff like that. And uh, yeah, but obviously kind of my, my work's quite messy and I kind of, Spraying glue and varnishing and stuff, and uh, I don't know. I think it's that would maybe I'd be more comfortable doing that in a kind of separate area where it's okay to kind of get messy and get. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's not really, I don't think. Um, I, I think I've had a great year in here. Um, 
it's been quite a challenge kind of balancing college and my business and things like that but I think I've done it quite well um, even from that the college kind of aspect of it having a station where I can and work from um, and that kind of made it balance and everything a bit easier. I've got a station here that has my college work and my business work on it. And um, so that kind of lets me do, or let me do a couple of hours of college work and then a couple of hours following up on emails and things like that. Um, so yeah, the fact that it's here, it's great. It's been perfect. So.